brother's wounds are not healing as well as we would like. He says that it hurts him to even move. Master Sima Zhao. Oh, here we go. Another crisis, no doubt. <sighs> Guan Xu Jian and Wen Qin are said to have rebelled in Shou Chun. What? Guan Xu Jian fought well against Wu, and has always been unflinchingly loyal to Wei. I find the reports hard to believe. He was always close to Xiao Xuan. I suppose seeing Xiao Xuan executed was what prompted him to make his move, just like Xiao Ba. Master Sima Zhao, I don't believe we have time for this. Hold your tongue, Master John Hui. But Master Zhao, with Master Xi unable to respond, it will be up to you to put down this rebellion. I know I made my brother a promise that I would support him to the last. But will killing Guan Chu Jian really help bring peace? I feel like suppressing one rebellion will simply lead to another springing up in its place. Master Sima Zhao, our kingdom is in crisis, and you would indulge in such leisurely debate? Your brother would be decisive and lead us to the light. We cannot leave this to you. I will head to Xu Chong myself and prepare for battle. Master Zhao. I know. I'll need you with me, Yuanji. Master Jugo Dun is disturbingly fragile. That's what comes of being overly devoted to Master Sima Shi. And yet, Master Sima Zhao doesn't have the leadership ability to control him. Well, this chaos will only help me climb to the top. Our previous northern campaign ended as a disappointing failure. In order to make sure that this does not happen again, I intend to make our preparations still more airtight on this occasion. Do not listen to what Master Jiang Wei says, Lord Liu Shan. What are you saying, Huang Hao? Master Zheng Wei, while your mind is immersed in thoughts of war, what do you think is happening to Xu? Were it not for me, law and order within the kingdom would have collapsed completely, and Lord Liu Chan would have been greatly inconvenienced. I do not believe ignoring the tenets of good governance and causing problems for one's ruler are the qualities of a loyal retainer. But I have inherited the Prime Minister's grand dream of eliminating Wei. It is my duty as a loyal retainer to bring that dream to reality. It is also a necessity if we wish to build a land of virtue. Every battle we engage in makes our land weaker and poorer. Do you wish for Emperor Liu Shan to live his life like a mere peasant? You must stop this quarreling, both of you! Zheng Wei, I appreciate your commitment, but Huang Hao is right. I do not want to make the people live a life of abject poverty. Is there not some other way? I will simply do what I must as a loyal retainer. Huang Hao, you must do the same. If each of us demonstrates wholehearted commitment to our cause, then the land will be fine. <laughs> How dare you talk of loyalty? You don't know the meaning of the word. <sighs> Brother, are you sure? You're okay to be up? Don't worry about it. Oh. <laughs> I guess that was a dumb question. That looks pretty good on you. Hmm. Zhao. Listen. From here on, there is no going back. 
We can't rid ourselves of these foolish commoners by just scraping away those close to the Way Emperor. This coming world is something that we must build ourselves. However, Zhao, the Emperor is the fate of the land. No matter how our heart breaks, no matter how many lives we forsake, sometimes things just won't go our way. Brother. Zhao, I need everything you have to give. Help me to create a world that is governed by the Sima clan. For that, brother, we will gladly aid you. Right, you two? I can't believe how dependable you look. So I guess these wounds that were sustained were not in vain. Let's go. Let us aim for the top. <laughs> <laughs> Lord Jugo Dan, they say Guang Qiu Jian has joined forces with Wu. Can we really win now? There are rumors that there are other insurgents even here in Suchang. What should we do? Pull yourselves together, men. You are supposed to be the soldiers keeping this territory safe. If you act like frightened children, what will the people think? But my lord, Just calm down, everyone. Lord Sima Zhao, how are we supposed to calm down in a situation like this? With one rebellion after another, we just don't know who to trust anymore. Listen to me, everyone. Have faith in me. I have sworn that I will lead you through this time of turmoil. All you need do is follow my lead. Lord Sima Shi, your words bring us such comfort. I swear that I will follow you until the day I die. Wonderful, my lord. You are the only one who can bring composure back to the ranks. Brother, should you be up and about in your state? Zhao, uh, uh, this rebellion must be put down with all haste. We must not open the door to cliques opposing the Sima clan, or other kingdoms which may have designs on invading. But brother... Do not worry. You and I can handle this, right? Brother! Surely you don't intend to fight. Brother, you're so... Very well. I'll go with you and make sure you stay alive. Master Sima Shi, we have captured the fleeing Guan Chu Jian. Hmm? Is Master Sima Shi not here? His wounds were giving him some trouble, so he went back home to Shu Chung ahead of us. I'm sorry, but you'll have to make your report to me instead. Please continue. Very well. Wen Qin and Wen Yang have fled to Wu and are already beyond our reach. That Guan Chu Jian really is a blundering idiot. He wastes the Wu reinforcements he was given, and despite the presence of the brilliant Wen Chin in his ranks, he still finds a way to lose. I must admit, although he was my enemy, I was deeply impressed by Wen Chin's son, Wen Young. Chasing him to Wu may eventually come back to haunt us. Zhao, listen to me for a second. Yuan Ling, Guan Chiu, Jun. Wen Jin, 
I feel there is a common thread among these defectors. I think we should be looking beyond them to see who is really pulling the strings. Yeah. Lord Sima Zhao! It's Lord Sima Shi. He has collapsed in his home. What? I have to get back to Xu Chong at once. Brother! Damn, this is all because of that wound you took back in the battlefield. If father were here, he would call you a fool. There is no profit in regretting what is past. Now, I understand my fate completely. It was my fate to bridge the gap that grew between you and the Sima family line. Please don't say that, brother. That is way too much responsibility for me to bear. Zhao, is your Master Xi's final words. Engrave them on your soul. Jia Chong, how dare you! But he is correct. Zhao, my final act is to entrust you with everything. <laughs> Draw together those with talent. Open a path to a new age, to the future of Zhao Wei. I hear that Master Sima Shi's injuries are quite severe. He was forced to cede power to his younger brother, Master Sima Zhao. That is quite the stroke of luck for our cause. Master Sima Zhao is nothing like his father or brother. I have a feeling the end is near for the Sima clan. What are you saying? The only reason Wei's been able to face the other two kingdoms is because of the leadership of Master Sima Yi and Master Sima Shi. If the Sima clan doesn't take charge, Wei will fade into obscurity. Is Master Sima Zhao up for the challenge, though? <laughs> <laughs>